I think I probably mentioned in the other video that really this lesson isn't any different than the last one. Um, dividing rational expressions is um, you know, virtually exactly the same process as multiplying rational expressions. The only difference is that you invert the second fraction first. So I'm just going to go through another uh, example here. Uh, this is actually the guided practice in your text. And I'm just going to go through it step by step with you, just a little bit more uh, exposure to the process. But really, uh, the same key applies here as applied in the last lesson, and that is that you want to get good at factoring. The better you are at factoring, the easier all of your uh, rational expressions are going to be because the less actual math you have to do, uh, obviously the you know the more time you're going to save and the less effort you have to put out. So let's um let's take a look. The uh, guided practice says 3x squared minus 15x over 2x squared plus 3x minus 14 divided by x squared minus 25 over 2x squared plus 13x plus 21. So this actually, you know, obviously does look a little long and obnoxious. And interestingly enough, this one, uh, they actually wrote it for you kind of nice because I've seen a number of times um, just because it uh, tends to freak students out. <laughs> I've seen problems like this often written this way, which really looks looks difficult just because you know it looks like this giant fraction um, where honestly the you know the problem isn't any different but you end up with this fraction over a fraction instead of having the division symbol here the problem would be written this way where you have you know this whole big fraction and then that's written over another one and you know I always always recommend whenever you have a fraction over a fraction the first thing you do is go back and and write it linearly the way that you know this one was given to us here because it makes it a whole lot easier to straighten out and and uh, invert so that you can do the actual multiplication so all we need to do here uh, with this problem the first thing we want to do is just take that you know this second expression here and invert it so that we can multiply instead of divide so we're just going to take the same information I'm going to write it upside down um, I'm just going to actually delete this here because there's no reason to have it. Once we have it to have it written down, I'll just delete this and write that back in uh, the inverted method. So we'll have uh, 2x squared plus 13x plus 21 over x squared minus 25. And now we're multiplying instead of dividing, and we just multiply straight across. So obviously a lot easier, but really, again, the only difference between the multiplication and division is that we have to do that inversion first. Now we're right back to the same kind of problems we had in the last lesson. So now we need to factor. If we factor starting with this top expression here, we can pull out a 3x. So we'll have 3x times x minus 5. And then if we factor the bottom expression, this is a trinomial and it factors as 2x plus 7 over x minus 2. Then we'll just multiply that straight across. And this one, top expression here, factors as 2x plus 7 times x plus 3. And x squared minus 25 is a difference of squares. So it's going to be x plus 5 times x minus 5. So now we have everything factored. We'll go through and cancel before we do any actual multiplication. We got an x minus 5 there and an x minus 5 there. Um, we have 3x. Uh, I got a 2x plus 7 here and a 2x plus 7 here. And that looks like it. So now on top we have 3x. Actually, you know, let me change colors so that we can keep our steps separated here. We have 3x times x plus 3 over x minus 2 times x plus 5. And you can either leave your answer in that form, or if you want to go ahead and distribute it out, you'd get 3x squared plus 9x over x squared plus 3x minus 10. There you go. So again, very similar to the last lesson, just invert your second fraction first and practice your factoring because it will make your life a lot easier.